to my channel. My name is Nostalgia. If you're new here, I would love it if you would subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. For today's video, I'm sharing with you guys the living room makeover in terms of the decorate with me. Now this living room got a full renovation at the end of last year. I uploaded that living room renovation video just a few weeks ago. So if you guys missed that video, I'm gonna link it down below. I'll insert a clip here of actually what this room looked like before and then a little clip of what it turned out to look like after. But I did mention to you guys in that video that I wanted to wait and fully furnish and decorate in another video. So that is what we're doing today. Super excited for that because I actually was able to partner with Castlery on today's video and I absolutely love their furniture. I'm a huge fan and I just love the meaning behind their brand in general. They believe that furniture should last, look good, and be honestly priced. And I think those are things that are really important when it comes to purchasing furniture. You really want it to look good, but you also want it to be great quality and last and you want it to be honestly priced. So that is their story behind their products and I really love that about their brand. So I'm excited to share with you guys the furniture pieces that they sent over as well as do a little living room makeover and decorate with me video. So I will have everything that I show in today's video linked in the description box down below for you guys to check out. And without further ado, we can just jump right into it. All right, just wanted to start by sharing with you guys what the space looked like before we go ahead and start with the fun little makeover. So as you guys see, we have a decent size living room space that we're going to be working with. And for the most part, I did clear out almost everything because we are going with like a kind of different vibe slash design for this one. So I definitely wanted to start fresh with this makeover. All right, so starting off in this corner, this is the Nagel TV console stand. And what I'm actually going to be using this for is just like a console with a little bit of storage for now. I don't have a TV for this room yet, but if I do get one, this is literally perfect. I love the fact that it came pretty much 95% assembled. All I had to do was attach those legs and I just love the sleek look of those legs on the bottom. They're very thin and they look so great. But they're super sturdy metal. And then again, I'm so happy that this was already put together because this would have been super difficult, I feel like, to put together myself. So I love that it was already assembled and then it has this really nice storage in there with that pop of red so you can totally store stuff in there and then you can just close that back it's such a good quality so i'm super excited about this piece and now we can go ahead and style the rest of this area all right so my first thought for over here is i'm actually going to switch this art piece around just because i think it will look better going this direction over here and i want to put like a lamp and a plant and then just a little bit of decor on here. I don't want it to overpower this piece because I love the detailing on it. So we're gonna go ahead and add those in now. All right, and then in this corner is where I'm gonna set the little plant stand. So that's a little stand piece. And then I'm going to add in the actual planter right here. All right, I already know that I'm going to have to adjust these leaves a little bit probably fit here. All right, so I knew I wanted to do layers, textures, and then different heights over on this side of the living room. So I'm going ahead and putting in this kit stool, also from Castlery, and love the texture, love the mixing, the different tones of the wood. And this fabric is seriously so soft. And this was also like great to add, like a little bit of extra seating if you wanted to like sit. So it kind of serves the purpose and we'll have it off just kind of like in this corner over there. All right, and then to style the console, I just wanted to bring in some decorative objects. And I wanted them to be black to kind of play off of the black legs of the console. So I have those. And then I have this as well, which I'm gonna go ahead and add some books in there. All right, and I'm just gonna add in to here some of my favorite decor books because they look really nice in this. You can actually store records in here if you really wanted to, or magazines, but I like to use it for books. Absolutely in love with the way everything turned out over here. I'm gonna take a step back so you guys can see like the full 
picture there it looks so good it's exactly the look that i was going for as i mentioned i kind of wanted like more like palm springs palm desert vibes like mid-century modern with a little bit of like art deco i didn't want things to be like simple i wanted to put a fun little twist on it again i love the look of this not sure what i'm gonna put in the console here but i love the fact that there's storage in there because you know sometimes we have stuff that we need to like keep and there's definitely a lot of room in there which is good too so i can put like extra stuff in there like extra candles or my candle wick trimmer you know things that you don't want to have sitting out and that is a kind of what i like to do i love pieces like this where they look really good and they also serve a purpose so you get this like really nice console piece but you also get the storage within there that's how i keep everything like looking clean like this and very minimal and simple because just wait after i'm done filming i'm gonna go ahead and put all of my stuff that i don't want anyone to see within that little console and that is how you can keep the little minimal look going all right i just wanted to show you guys how well the rug is kind of like tying everything in and together it looks great with everything over there so excited to open the sofa as well as the ottoman i just wanted to mention that the fact that after i opened this furniture got it unboxed it had these protective bags on it which is genius because sometimes when you're cutting you know the wrapping and stuff you might accidentally like slip through no these have these protective little bags on them that they are perfect they actually zip up so you can totally save these and if i ever move i can put everything right back in here and it doesn't get messed up i thought that that was super impressive i have not seen a furniture company do that before so just wanted to mention that you're going to bring the sofa pieces on to the rug now i think i'll be able to do this myself actually yep all right here's one piece of the sofa so far i'm just going to kind of twist it and get it in the position that I want it to be in. What do you think? Right here is like perfect. Grab the other piece here and connect them and then I'll open up the little bags as they come in. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and unzip the first part of this sofa now. So you guys will be able to see what it looks like. I'm super excited because it's like a really pretty gray color. And I already did take a little sneak peek. Seriously, so happy. I did take a sneak peek of the ottoman because it matches. This is seriously so beautiful. It's such a pretty gray. So I'm gonna go ahead and unzip the other piece and then I'll get those like put together. All right, so the sofa is actually a part of the Todd collection. It does connect within the bottom. I will go ahead and latch that together when I have help. So I just thought that this would be a great addition to the living room. Again, I love like the modular look. It's very trendy, very in. And then I love the fact that it does have the matching ottoman as well, which I will probably just place right here. I'm gonna go ahead and open that up now. I'm actually going to style this to just kind of be like off to the side. And it's super easy to slide it up if you actually wanted to use it as an ottoman as part of this sofa. But seriously, this is super soft and it's so comfortable. A lot of times these modular pieces look good, but they're not comfortable, but this one's actually super comfy. So I'm gonna go ahead and add a few pillows and then put in the coffee table as well. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and bring in the coffee table now. This is just a piece that I already had that I thought would fit perfect here. It's white, so I really wanted to kind of brighten things up. So I'm just gonna use that here. I think it just looks really 
perfect. Again, it needs like a pop of like bright to go along with the whole space. Then I'm gonna go in and add a little bit more texture to the sofa. And I'm gonna do that by adding in these handmade pillows. So I just have one with a little bit of stripe detailing and then one with a little more stripe detailing but just more texture to it. I'm gonna keep the coffee table very simple since there's already so much going on within the room. I'm just adding in a book and then this is just like a little textured air plant piece that I already had just kind of to balance out some of the earthy tones in here. I wanted to add that to the coffee table so it's not so like stark white. All right guys, I think we are done with the new living room design and I cannot tell you how much I love this. It is so cozy, so practical, super comfortable, but still looks really good. So it's exactly what I was looking for when I wanted to make over the living room again because I wanted it to be a cozy space, but I still wanted it to look super good. So I definitely think that these castlery furniture pieces helped me achieve the look I wanted. I'm so pleased with them. Thank you guys so much for watching this living room makeover video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And again, a huge thank you to Castlery for sending over these pieces and making this living room makeover possible. Don't forget to check the description box down below because I will have all the links that you guys need to find in terms of this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video.